For this demonstration, I'm going to demonstrate a latch and unlatch function. This is with a yellow light output instruction, output colon 2 slash 0. You notice there's an L here for this output instruction. That stands for latch, not light, but latch. We have the same address below, which stands for unlatch. We have two separate inputs for this function, switch 0 which is tied to input 0 and switch 1 that's tied to input 1. And I've made both of those push buttons normally open spring return uh, push buttons instead of toggle switches like this one here at input 2. So while the system's running I'm continually scanning these XICs are looking for a 1. Are you a 1? No. So it's false. Are you a 1? No. It's false goes back up to the scan cycle and scans all over again. So when I press this down, I'm holding it, now during the scan cycle, the answer to that question is yes, I'm a 1. So that input 1, 0 goes true. You can see that that is in line with our output O colon 2 slash 0, or the yellow light, and that makes that output instruction go true. When I release this input, that output stays true. You can see the yellow light stays true or on. It went from a 0 to a 1. The only way I can get that output instruction to turn off is to cause a true here and send a signal to the unlatch instruction for that same output address. So I'll do that and I'll hold it down and you can see that switch 1 is true you can see by the highlighting yellow above switch 1, and that has deactivated or unlatched the yellow light, output 0. I'll release my uh, switch 1, and it remains unlatched. Latched, unlatched. You can see the output here. Latched, unlatched. 